Hello everyone, this is uh, Elijah Ignatia from the New Paradigm Toolkit. And right now we're taking a look at the Harmony Map, which is at the community level. And if you look at the words, science, economics, education, technology, arts, health, philanthropy, politics, governance, and community, you see there are a lot of different aspects of society. And each one of these aspects of society can have a value that is going to be the primary, almost energy conduit for that concept to come into being in a society that you can design for the future. Because what we're looking at here is a map to see and to program, to design a society or culture or paradigm where we begin to choose conscious values around what we would like to see or what we want to participate in. And so if you have here at education, the value, if you have the value of safety, you are going to have a very different educational system than if you have the value of freedom. You got to get that one. Education, if your prime value is safety, it's going to be a totally different educational system than if you put the prime value of freedom. Now, I'm not saying which one you should choose, but to consciously be able to distinguish the differences between what kind of society would we be in if we had truth at politics, or if we had cooperation at health, or if we had uh, simplicity at technology. This would create a very different culture. And so today we have so many different worldviews. We have so many different ways of seeing the world based upon different value systems, based upon different worldviews. What the inflow matrix does, which this is part of, is a way to consciously map out from the individual to the group to the community all the different aspects of society and in your own life and the relationship between them so you can create a conscious value system for yourself and then the idea is that as a team or as a community you find ways to create conscious value systems together which become the reference point for you to design your ideal job and for you to design your ideal organization and for you to design your ideal community and to do that together and create a whole new world so if I'm over here and I'm looking through the philanthropy lens, it's very different from me being here looking through the technology lens. These are two different ways of seeing. And what we need to understand as humans is not only to see the world through different lenses, but to understand what are the lenses we are looking through when we are talking about a certain subject. And what are the lenses and perspectives that someone else is looking through? Because if I'm looking through the, the lens of, from the point of view of philanthropy, and you're looking through the lens of technology, and we're speaking about some community problem, if we both understood that, it would be huge in order to understand why we saw things differently and what we were actually arguing about or for. So the maps help us to create a mind map for us to understand the larger systems we're involved in and to have a methodology then to begin to talk about issues and problems and situations from a more holistic point of view. If you are interested in creating your own conscious value system, either at the community, the group, or at the individual level, give me a shout and we can get one done real fast.